Let's attach files to our Foxit PDF. I've got a document here, and I'm actually going to resave this document. And I'm going to create a special folder for it on our C drive. And I'm just going to call it Attach Files. And it's a normal PDF. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach files. Now there's different ways of doing this. The easiest way, of course, is using the navigation pane and we're looking for the attach right here. The other way of doing it is go to the edit tab or ribbon and file attachment. You can see there is nothing currently attached. Across the very top though there is an icon with a plus sign and let's add a file. And let's go and find some files. Now I have numerous files in here. I have my logo in here. I'm going to open that. Now it's a JPEG. And I'm going to add another file. And I'm going to find Combining Files, which is a PowerPoint. And I'm going to add one more. And I'm going to add a Word file. So notice there's a PPTX, a DOCX, and a JPEG. Do you think they're going to be converted to PDF? Well, let's say OK. And they're not. Now we're going to resave this file with these attachments with a different name. And we'll just change the name with attachments. And we'll close the file. Now let's go down to our File Explorer into our C drive. And notice the difference. Our attachments file is larger. Well, that's to be expected. Let's open that attachments file. And the original files are still here, as we can see. Now we could delete them, right? We can look at the settings of any particular one. We can add another one. We could create a subfolder in here or we can just open that attachment. Let's open that attachment. And we're going to open it, and it's going to open up in Microsoft Word. Now my Word is going to ask me to log in, which I kind of expected, but there's the file. It is going to be one PDF with these attachments within the file. And that's how we do file attachments with a Foxit PDF. If you've liked this video, please like and subscribe.